time before the season, we was all in there like, like, hey, bro, like, we about to win. You know what I'm saying? Like, they, they know, and, you know, coach, everybody looking at us, like, coach, coach Pete felt that energy, too. Everybody felt that energy, like, bro, you gonna, you gonna have to get attacked, bro. Like, like <laughs> you can't say serious about that, you know what I'm saying? So, it was dope because the way the city is, you know, we don't got no other professional sports. So, it's just, it's just, it's Louisville. And, you know, and now that I know and I've got a chance to meet a bunch of guys in the city, it's like, that's what we rock with. We ain't rock with nobody else. We don't want to see no other pro teams. We don't want to see no other, anybody come through here. If it ain't the Cardinals, man, we ain't tripping on nothing else but them. And for us to be out, out there and to rock out the way we did and to have the effect that we have in the city, to me, that's dope. And I, and I appreciate the support. But, like, but like it was for us like it was really it was amazing too like we had that same type of feeling so like we wasn't we wasn't skimping like the the, the ambiance so the aura that the whole city had we wasn't just like oh man i i don't know what they are but we were doing this anyway nah we was we was really feeling what everybody else was feeling too i'm glad that energy could be yeah that. that energy was definitely in there like and then everybody on the team like that's what I'm saying. One day we're going to have a 30 for 30 because, like, our Man. team was so crazy, bro. Like, Peyton could be in one spot, and we don't, we didn't need, like, a lot of basketball teams, and they need they, the team to be considered the, the team. So, like, if you if you go to a, a party or if you go to a spot, you need the whole team to be there to recognize that the team is there. Nah, like, Pey, like Peyton could be at one spot, and, like, Peyton was there, like, and it's good. It's going to be lit. Shane and Kev might be somewhere else on campus. Like, and that side of campus is lit. Shane and Kev there. And then at that point in time, like, I was ridiculous. And I was, like, the one of the biggest things in college basketball. And I had my whole own wavelength. So, like, I'm, I'm rolling with managers. I'm rolling with people from the student band. Like, and it's like, oh, Russ Dickless is at this frat party. Russ Dickless is at this sorority party. Russ Dickless is somewhere, you know, getting wild. Like, I, I never never thought I'd be in the NBA, so I never thought I had to carry myself in that in that type of manner. Right, you know what right. I mean? So I'm out there with the students rocking out, like, and I'm and I'm out there with the, the people from the yeah. city. Like, I'm with them people. Like, you know what I'm saying? This, and it was dope, so I didn't really need the whole basketball team to be with me. I ain't roll with the basketball team. I don't roll with the football team. I'm rolling by myself, bro. And... That's how that 13 went, that 2012 all that was, and and that and then we winning, we rocking out, and we finally we marching through the through the Big East, we marching through the through the uh, tournament, and we just making noise, and everybody on our team got their own little vibes going, and whoever they talk to, whoever they with, so I mean it was for real like being it was real life like being a, being a pro for real, and we was in college, and that was the, and that was the dope part. So when all the stuff came out about like we needed the patient, we sitting there like, what, bro? Like, <laughs> what are you talking about? Like, yeah, we got the city lit right got, now. It's, man, it's it's so jumping right now. You think we gonna actually, you know, like pay for some females? Like, like what are y'all talking about, bro? Like, we don't we don't need we don't need to do none of that. Like, we. We crazy like we, we, this. This Peyton right here, like he. It, but people don't. People don't. If people that haven't been in this city don't understand that concept, though. Right. So it's okay. Y'all don't gotta understand that concept. But I ain't apologizing for nothing. The city was lit. It was rocking, and and one and people going and people definitely gonna be happy. We definitely gonna go down like in history. Not maybe what we done for basketball, but for. Now I understand for when people say what y'all done for the city, now I get it. Like, it took me, you know, years of reflection to see what was done. I mean, bro, like, you'll go to Captain Quarters, bro. It was crazy. You'll go, ah, like, you'll go out to the Quarters West End. That time was crazy. It was crazy. Like, I was, I was around a time where I was, I was walking in Phoenix Hill. It was good. It was crazy. Phoenix Hill was, was <laughs> rocking. I'm, I'm out there on 4th. RP Phoenix Friday. Hill. RP Phoenix Hill. 4th Street was rocking. Like so, y'all own Fourth Street. Yeah, yeah. We, bro. <laughs> I remember. Come on, bro. Like, like, I'm, like I'm pulling up. You know what I'm saying? Like even, even like after, like even after, like or whatever. Like um, the way the way we was pulling up in there, it was totally different. Like we was in college too, so ain't nobody, do, ain't nobody gonna do that. Ain't, ain't, ain't the. It's gonna be, it's gonna take a lot for a bunch of players 
to have that effect on us the way the city did. Not, the Louisville probably win a, win a chip, you know what I'm saying? Because they're, they're, good, they're a good enough school. But to have that effect, like yeah, each yeah. player individually I mean, had, that'll never happen. Never yeah. happen, bro. Like, even even, even somebody like a Gorgie Ding had his, bro, like he was the man. Bro, yeah, yeah. like if Gorgie popped out, you're like, what, bro? That's Gorgie. He popped out today. Like, and Gorgie never really used to pop out. Like, if Gorgie was to show up here in Louisville right now, you know how the people would just, yeah. The mom man. would go crazy. They'd go man. crazy. He, Absolutely like, insane. Even Luke. Van Cheese, Tim, like there were there were times where you no know, we'd be we'd be out and like we'll have we'll be um I mean this is college so like we're on the we're on the bars and we're in the bars and stuff we going crazy we we raging and we had everybody rocking with us like the other sports is watching us rock out like I mean other so, other hey, people watching them. us rock yeah. out like we like hey bro like. <laughs> Y'all need to get on our level. Yeah, like, so, like for real, it was, it was, kind, it was kind of like that, but it wasn't like we, we shitting on y'all. It was just everybody was lit. But then after a while, that energy started reciprocating. Then the other teams was like, we rocking out with y'all. Like you'll see me painting up, painting up for the soccer games. Mind you, I'm there with the number one draft pick for soccer. The like one of the he, the other draws was, was like a was like a, a top swimmer in the country, one of the Olympic swimmers. It was, it was like baseball was popping, everything Bro, was. We was, had we had was the, was the year of the Cardinal, yeah. man. Even, like even in 2012, was, so we all grew up with each other. Like we all came in with each other, all grew up with each other. So we all got got lit. We all got lit at the same. Was time. Teddy the quarterback too? Teddy yeah, was that's the quarterback. Man. Yeah. We had Devonte Parker here. So what you think Vontae was doing? He was out here acting <laughs> a damn fool. Like you know what I'm saying? Bunch of NFL draft yeah. picks from those teams. It was great. Marcus, Mar- Marcus was my dog. Marcus Smith was out out here. Um, First round for the thing. Eagles. We had four Olympic swimmers. I was going to, but that's the thing. I was going to the swimmer parties too. Like I know sw- swimmers, swimmers. If people don't know, if you've never been to college, swimmers get hard. down. <laughs> they, get in, yeah, like, they get in more than the football players. I'm yeah. trying to tell people that. Like the football players go hard, but that's because there's a hundred of them. But the swimmers, bro. Nobody go hard like Swimmers that. Are parties and they have legendary <laughs> parties that's on any campus yeah. across America. Yes, bro. I love I love hanging out with the swimmers. It was, uh, one of my dudes I used to hang out with. The dude was uh Matt, and he invited me to all this all of this uh, swimming parties. You know, I thank him for that. Um, we also had um, a lot of the uh, the, soc- the soccer the soccer the uh, soccer the soccer house the soccer parties was good when I was here and stuff. But I knew a lot of the, the soccer players, and I go to all their games. Them. I know a bunch of the guys on the track team, so I I be with a lot of the track people, like the women's team. So I was so for me, like I don't know if my teammates had that same experience, but I know they was moving around a little bit. But I got a chance to experience all that. So all along. So this is just it's like you getting to know me, like so. This is my mm-hmm. take on everything, and when all the, the 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 scandal, I'm like scandal, you know scandal, like. I don't even I mean That's a recruiting violation Whatever that was Like you take that up With the recruits Like Right (laughs) That's the thing That that pissed me off With it Because At the end of the day That was Technically If you want to call it What it was That's uh, Benefits received Yeah Okay So that's what That's what it was classified as And it had a dollar amount on it and we wanted to put more about character and a bunch of other yeah. stuff and make it, you know, some emotional decisions. But that was, it was a dollar amount in the story. That's what yeah. it should have been classified. That's what it should have been. That's, That's what it should have been as far as recruits. Grand as far opening, as, grand close. Yeah, as far as, as far as, recruit, as far as recruiting goes, all right, cool. Well, you, some, some, somebody set up a party and had women who I thought the dude, like, knew. And I was like, you know, his people from when he went to school here. Right. I don't, I, like, I'm not even thinking shit because I'm thinking... I'm going. I'm going to the I'm going to the sorority. I'm gonna, yeah, yeah. I'm going to I didn't have, bro. I didn't have. I didn't have parties where it was like, it was just flooded, like just full of, you know, just full of, full of females in there. Like, and it's like, there's nothing much to think about it. I have my teammates over. Have have some of my guys from uh, the frat because I used to, I used to uh, rock with the Teeks a lot. I was almost an honorary pledge for them. So, I'll be with those dudes a lot, and you know, we'd we'd like we'll get it in. We'll have a bunch of fun, and and that was dope. And then and then obviously like later on when I when I became a senior and stuff, and the very end of my junior year started dating, dating my girl. So you know all that like all like the rah rah stuff like died down. But the beginning, like my first like two and a half three years here at school, man, it was. It was like, what? Are, what are we paying for? You know yeah, what I'm saying? Like, why do we need any? Why are we paying for benefits? Like, we get, 
you know, what we want here through the means of, you know, not paying for anything, but we don't need to pay for anything. Nah, man, right. it's Louisville basketball like, yeah. in the store. Like, like you I said, mean, we, we don't have a pro like team everybody here. Else. Yeah. Like, no, we pay for our shit like everybody else. Right. Like, we don't need to go out of our way to go, to, hey, yeah. we, we need yeah. services. Yeah. Like, nah, that's not what was going on. But, you know, people that's not looking, people that's not been in the city or, like, guys that may not have been in the situation we was in. They're like, oh, these kids are out here. Like, eh, nah, like, that, that ain't what it was. That ain't even what it was. But they won't ever understand that. It's, it's the culture and it's all good. I, I, I'm i not apologizing for nothing. Man, it, it's 